Twinning Scheme is a programme that puts practising lawyers and training lawyers into schools to work with young people to develop their understanding and awareness about the law. It helps to give those young people real contact with and a real understanding of how the law works. The Citizenship Foundation was originally established to get a knowledge and an understanding of the law to those young people least likely to get that in their daily lives. With law featuring strongly within that national curriculum, twinning has a major contribution to work. Our school became involved in the twinning scheme after being contacted by the Citizenship Foundation. We're very keen to have professionals in school teaching our pupils the um, legal aspect of the citizenship curriculum. It's quite a challenging area of the curriculum that a lot of our teachers don't really feel confident in teaching their classes and the pupils have found it really interesting having real professionals teach them that aspect of the course. They can um, put a tag on so your ankle and tell you what time you should be in your house and if you're not in the house at that certain time then they can come round and look for you, they're going to rush you. Yeah, you get a curfew. Yeah, curfew. Can I do? Yeah. Typically a group of solicitors, trainee solicitors or other legal professionals from a law firm or a law centre are attached to a local school. They go into that school for perhaps six to eight sessions. Uh, we have a set of materials on which those sessions are based and they work with groups of young people to develop their understanding and their awareness about the law. The twinning programme was initiated in 1999 with the support and encouragement of Linklaters, one of the city's top law firms. They were joined in 2004 by Slaughter and May. Linklater's strategy for community investment has always had a strong focus on education and helping children fulfil their greatest potential. We're always interested in finding new and innovative ways of achieving that. Slaughter and May got involved in the twinning scheme because we were looking for new legal volunteering opportunities and also for some projects involving secondary schools in the local area. And obviously the twinning scheme ticked both of those boxes to meet our needs. We found it surprisingly easy to recruit volunteers for the twinning scheme. Uh, we originally piloted it in one of our groups and after a successful first year we rolled it out to the rest of the firm and have had no problem in recruiting volunteers. Jessica and myself have been coordinating the scheme here in Linklaters for about the last year and we've been involved in everything from recruiting new volunteers, um, especially when new trainees start, we try and uh, nobble them to come and get involved. We also coordinate the timing of, of all the visits to the two schools we work with and set up teams to go into the school for every visit. The Twinning Scheme has been a great success this year. Um, we've had lawyers coming in once every half term to work with classes and the girls have absolutely loved the sessions. And over the course of the year, the same lawyers have often come in and have built up a really good rapport with the students. I think the relationship really develops over the sessions throughout the year. Um, in the first session, they're a bit confused by who you are and, and what exactly you're doing in their school, but I think by the sixth session of the year, they're really used to seeing you. And, and I always like to hear the teachers saying that they look forward to seeing us, and I often wonder if they're the only people in the country that actually look forward to seeing lawyers. They should be allowed to keep it there for as long as they need to. So how long could that be? Could that be a week? So that's just like saying, yeah, they'll, they'll just tell you to come in on one day, yeah, and they'll just leave you in the waiting room and say, yeah, we'll be with you in a minute, yeah, and they just wait all day, yeah, and they just leave you there. So you're trying to say, yeah, you just let them do that. It's good working with actual lawyers that do this sort of stuff every day because when it's coming from someone who actually does it, you learn a lot more. Client side was normally true, so yes. normally it's not for 24 hours. One is wearing a hoodie. The support we receive is both in the firm and also in the school. So in the firm we have liaison officers who sort of help us to set up a rotor and, and, and make sure there are always enough people there in the session. Um, and then at the school we always have a teacher coming to sit in the session with us who often joins in. And so do you think a crime has been committed? They teach you lots of stuff telling you like if it's true or false, is it good or right, at the right age you get arrested, if you can get interviews, solicitors, lawyers, all these great stuff. Teach you, it's wonderful. This is my second week and I'm enjoying it already. I want to come again. The scheme has really benefited our students. They've found it really useful meeting real professional people. They've felt really uh, privileged that they've had top city lawyers in their school and have been asking can they have a law GCSE? Could there be any more sessions? They've become much more confident in their um, GCSE choices. The students have got a lot out of it. Thank you. I think the confidence of speaking to adults, to working with professionals that have come in and just gaining that confidence, thinking that their views are being listened to and actually participating in groups in that way. 
Well, for the law firm, there are a number of benefits. Uh, firstly, there's the professional development of the lawyers. Uh, the lawyers that have worked on the scheme have said to us time and again that they have developed their understanding uh, of the young people and, and how uh, law is taught or can be taught uh, in schools through taking part. Uh, there's reputational benefits for the law firm. There's a way in which the scheme connects the firm with its local community. We try to provide a range of both legal and non-legal volunteering opportunities um, for everyone in the firm and the twinning scheme uh, met a number of these needs for our legal staff. I've greatly enjoyed taking part in the twinning scheme. It's uh, always a great um, pleasure for me to try and give something back to the community and try and help particularly uh, school kids uh, learn a little bit about the law and how it can affect them in a practical way. I've really enjoyed taking part in the twinning scheme. It's such a change from what I do at work. Um, just going in on a Wednesday morning makes the whole of the rest of the day seem better because I've spoken to different people and done something entirely different and it's wonderful. I really enjoy taking part in the scheme. Um, I enjoy coordinating because it's really fun, the enthusiasm of the new volunteers. But I also really enjoy going on the visits and even though we no longer have to, we do go regularly um, because it's just so much fun. It's really nice to get out of the mm. office and it's really nice to have a couple of hours where you're just mixing with young people and talking to them and, and I, I genuinely think that I learn something new every time I go. I think it's very easy doing what we do to get caught up in the day-to-day -day grind of, of the office life here and actually to get in a taxi and go out to Hackney and, and meet with completely different people and talk about completely different things ranging from human rights to police powers. But that's the other great thing is that you go along to discuss a particular topic and you have the session set out for you and you have exercises to go through but quite often you're just responding to what the children want to speak about. And that can be authorised up to a maximum of 96 hours. Yeah. Our volunteers enjoy taking part in the twinning scheme and if they didn't we wouldn't continue to do it so I would highly recommend it to other firms. I would certainly recommend uh, the twinning programme to other lawyers. I think it's very important for lawyers to get uh, some exposure to the community in general and uh, I think the twinning program does that in a very uh, very useful way. Linklet is very pleased to have been instrumental in setting up the twinning scheme which is going from strength to strength and we fully endorse its spreading across the UK and London. I would recommend it to anybody not just lawyers but especially lawyers because you can share what you do know and your mm. the experiences you do have um, and also a whole load of stuff that you don't know about that you learn very, very quickly when, you're, when they ask you questions. And I, I think it's a, it's, it's a really great way to leave everything behind and get out for a few hours and, and do something really positive. I definitely recommend the scheme to other schools. It's been really beneficial. Um, the lawyers have been brilliant. I would 100% recommend this scheme to other schools. It's brilliantly organised by the Citizenship Foundation. It's really easy to run. The burden on the school is minimal. It's, simple for teachers to organise this programme. It may seem at first like it would be difficult and there's people coming into the school and all of these things do need organising but once it's up and running it's really sim a simple process and the pupils get so much out of it and as a teacher I've learnt a lot more about the law as well and how the pupils really respond to having professionals in schools. Our plan now is to roll out twinning uh, to a much wider range of the top law firms uh, in this country but also to community law firms, uh, to law centres and to others. We need to build a real partnership between the legal profession and schools and young people if we're going to make the most of the opportunities afforded by the citizenship curriculum and if we're going to extend young people's understanding of the law. My name's Tony Breslin, Chief Executive at the Citizenship Foundation. I'm Anthony Can, and I'm the senior partner of Linklaters. Jessica Rivette, and I work for Linklaters. Libby Clark, and I work for Linklaters. I'm Ben Stewart, I'm the community affairs manager at Slaughter and Main. I'm Lucy Beaumont, I'm a second seater trainee at the moment. I'm Daniel Kleinberg, and I work for Slaughter and May. Chloe Parker is Linton Green School. My name's Rebecca Warren, and I work for Skinner's Company School for Girls.